Hey, my legion. How y'all doing? I thought I'd do a review today, uh, making dinner for my dad. And, uh, I picked this up at the frozen food section at Walmart. These are Guy Fieri's tequila lime, or a fully cooked smoked tequila lime chicken sausage. It's garlic, uh, bell peppers, well, garlic tequila and bell peppers. So I thought I'd do a review of this. And if anyone remembers Guy Fieri, I always want to say Guy Fieri, but it's Guy Fieri. You know, on Food Network, he was doing a show called Driving's, uh, Diners, Drivings, and Dives. And I'd love to eat a lot of those places. They look really fantastic. He was doing he was uh, doing a show. He's still doing it now. And he was doing a great show on NBC uh, game show called Minutes to Win It. And he became prominent on Food Network. And he became one of the new stars. And he got all famous and stuff. And he had a restaurant. Uh, he opened up a couple locations. Boy, he got slammed really bad. I mean, they, they uh, the... Uh, the food uh, critics were so bad that uh, people were saying that and so nasty to his uh, restaurant they were considering like bullying and it was even on the nightly news how bad it was but I hope this stuff is good I mean there's three flavors at Walmart now these are the smaller specialty sausage these were $3.99 well $3.98 at Walmart and there's also the uh, oh, the fajita season ones I got I could I I'll probably review those later on you know and uh, also I wanted to review this is El Diablo's Hot and Spicy Smokehouse Mustard. Now I was going to do a, just a review just of this by itself. I think it would go good with the chicken. So, uh, And then probably at the end of the video I'll probably do a spoonful of this like I did at the end of the, my uh, Oxrose video with the, uh, uh, what the hell was it? The Horse Riders Challenge which was really fun. Alright, on with the review. Hey, now here's the cooked product. I wanted to show the whole sausage by itself right here, and also the cut-up sausage. And uh, <coughs> I'm trying to get all this damn cold. The cop don't want to seem to go away, you know. Well, anyways, I want to see uh, if I can taste the tequila and lime in this uh, turkey sauce. It has a uh, tight casing around it. So let's give it a shot. You can taste it just, you just taste it just slightly because, you know, alcohol evaporates when you cook it. And it's a very slight uh, tequila taste. But it's pretty good. You can taste, definitely taste the uh, bell peppers and the garlic. and But you can't taste any lime at all. So, that's that on that. And let's try it with some with the mustard. Okay. See how it goes with the mustard. Well, the mustard definitely helps it out a little bit. But these aren't too bad of a chicken sauce. I mean, a three ninety eight might be a little steep, but, I mean, these aren't bad sausage. So uh, they're at least worth trying once. I'd probably give these a, a 7 out of 10. I mean, not that bad, but you can't taste any tequila or lime in it whatsoever. So it's a little bit of false advertising on Guy Fieri's part. Part. Heh, <laughs> part. So, that's all I have to do with, uh, that's all I have to say with these. They're all right. So, if you want to try them, go, go ahead. They're not too bad. So, until next time, get ready for the mustard challenge. One thing after, this is, uh, uh hope you like my review. This is the uh, mustard challenge. After this, uh, at the very end of the video, I wanted to put the thumbnail that Tim, uh, gave me Dead TV with nice stuff to make for me. I think it would be funny. You know, the hot and spicy mustard. See how hot and spicy it is. Well, there we go. That should be good enough. Well, it's not that bad. Give you a little bit of heartburn there, but it wasn't like it wasn't like the uh, horseradish challenge. Sorry, disappointing. It gives you a little bit of heartburn though, but it's all right. 
So until next time, hey, check out the thumb of my buddy, Mamie Ann. Take care, Malita.